Music Theory, a complete course for grades 1 to 5. Lesson 31, Demi Semiquavers, suitable for grade 3 ABRSM and grade 5 Trinity College. Demi Semiquavers are worth half of a semiquaver, or in other words, one eighth of a crotchet and they are shown with three beams across the stems. Notice also how the demi semiquaver rest looks like. Demi semiquavers are usually grouped in beats with other notes. So in this example, you'll notice that the first four demi semiquavers, which make together half of a beat, are grouped with the quaver. So the other half of the beat makes a whole beat. Some composers, however, will group them just four at a time if they seem to be getting too many in a line and it becomes difficult to see where the beats are. Now, to see how much you have understood, can you tell me how many demi semiquavers are worth a dotted crotchet? Well, a dotted crotchet is worth three quavers, and three quavers are worth six semiquavers and six semiquavers are worth 12 demi semiquavers. Next, what time signature would you add to this extract? The two demi semiquavers in the middle will make one semiquaver. The dotted quaver at the beginning which, with the demi semiquavers, will make two quavers, and then there is a third quaver at the end of the first bar, thus making three quavers in a bar, or a time signature of 3 8 time. And finally, what rest would you need to add at the end of this bar? First of all, notice that there is a 4-4 time signature, and you have one crotchet, then two quavers, then a semiquaver, quaver, semiquaver rhythm. All of that makes three beats. And then you are left with just four demi semiquavers and an unknown rest to make the fourth beat. So, four demi semiquavers are worth two semiquavers or one quaver meaning that you would need to add another quaver rest to complete the bar. Now, I'll see you in the next video by clicking the card on the left, or if you want more practice on this topic, click the card on the right.